The truth about Trump collusion and obstruction in the Mueller report. Opinions, now this impact. Somebody put this on a chat group and I'm responding to it. I'm Artifacts of Mars and this is a Liberalism is a Mental Disorder update. Now, this video has a bunch of psychotic liberals, basically, Trump haters uh, with Trump derangement syndrome. So, we'll start with the bull, Robert De Niro. He's repeatedly threatened Trump, and he should be locked up in a jail cell as a result. I would be satisfied with seeing him locked up in a uh, rubber room, to be honest with you. He's a known psychotic liberal, and not somebody I would take for a source. So we're going to go through the list. I don't know all of them. Christine Laddie. I think I've heard her name. I listened to her. She uh, sounds like she's... Uh, not quite with it. I think she's a few cards short of a full deck. They hacked emails, spread lies on social media. Give me a friggin' break. And I'm trying to get this one guy. Well, it keeps uh, coming up with Lawrence Fishburne. Uh, I know less about this wacko liberal, but uh, he is obviously a Trump hater. I've heard his name. I'll see if I can get that one, another one up. I'm going to put it on pause. All right. Uh, Stephen King. Again, another psychotic liberal. He's one of the uh, so-called horror. There's actually very little in uh, horror content in his uh, stuff, but uh, he's also a psychotic liberal and a Trump hater, obviously. So we'll take a look at Sophia Bush. Never heard. Of her. Remember, this is done in this style where they uh, tell them what they're saying, you get a quick clip, and then, you know, they're clean. You get a quick clip, and then you move on to the next psychotic liberal. Oh, whoops. Meathead! Rob Reiner, otherwise known as Meathead, if, you've, if you're not familiar with the term, uh, Meathead refers to uh, a character on uh, an Archie Bunker, all in the family with Archie Bunker. He's a known liberal. Very, very nutcase. He's very uh, nutcase like. He's otherwise known as Meathead. Uh, total whack on as far as I'm concerned. Ray. 
Rosie Perez. I vaguely uh, heard of her. I don't know who she is, really. I may not have heard of her. I'm not sure. Seems to be the youngest one of the uh, bunch of psychotic liberals. And here is the ever kooky George Sakai, who is the uh, navigator on the Enterprise on Star Trek. Total, total nut job. I'm very disappointed in him. He shows stuck to Star Trek. But he's a Trump hater. He's basically a wacko. And here's the good guy, Donald Trump. Love you, Donald. I'll be voting for you. Kendrick Sampson, never heard of him. I have no ideas. A lot of these are Hollywood elitists, and my knowledge of Hollywood actors are, is rather uh, slim, to say the least. This kook isn't named. I have no idea who or what he is. No sense. Long shaggy hair, waxed handle, handlebar mustache, and beard. I have no idea who this is. Now you have that uh, Lawrence Fishburne psycho saying that's collusion. Well, you gotta remember, uh, this is five, this video is five years old. So, uh, how many of these, uh, psychos are still alive? I don't know. Robert De Niro is, he still hates Trump, and he's still threatening Trump. He should be in a jail cell for that. Um, uh, well, other than that, you know, you have it. They put these uh, psychotic liberals on they have them speak a little part, and then next one moves on, next one moves on. Very unimpressive. It's a very poor way to present information. I wouldn't pay any attention to them, to be honest with you. That's about it for now. A uh, bunch of basic, basically a bunch of kooks. Unbelievable. I don't even know why I even bother doing a video on them.